What's up everybody? Chill here to bring you a quick tutorial on this ripple effect tutorial. Or wow. But anyway, let's get started. What the hell? Okay. Thanks to first of all to Jalen, aka Gao Designs, for like making a good tutorial on this. And I already knew how to do it, but I'm gonna make a tutorial on it as well because he did a really good job of explaining it and stuff, so Alright, whatever whatever you're gonna do, alright. You're gonna want it to have it right before it headshots. So you're gonna split the clip right here, insert a new video track, go to media generators, um, color gradients, and a, drag in a, a yellow elliptical ring. Well, there's only. All right, you're gonna make it as long as you want, but you don't want it to be that long. What you're gonna, sorry, you're gonna go to generated media. And at the generated media, bring all three colors in and try to make it look like what I'm about to make it look like. Hold on. It's really hard to get it in the perfect spot. Try to get it on the first room try to get it like that with just a little bitty circle in the middle and you're gonna go to one second in and drag all of the numbers out now watch you can see it, it does that next what we're gonna do is this is alright hold on Try to click on number two if you can. And I just screwed everything up. Hold on. Okay. But you don't have to change really anything about it. But go over here to compositing mode and go to custom and change it to Sony height map. And as you can see. Now it shows kind of like a blur, which is pretty cute. Cool. And I'm not sure what happened to my keyframe at one second, but like I said, make sure this is all the way out. All five, all three numbers are out. And now you can see it. it. I don't know what my computer is being really laggy right now. And you can see it. It kind of ripples. But I'm gonna change this around to make it look more like a ring. So I'm going to go to compositing mode, custom, try to make this as big as it'll go with, but make sure you can still see the screen. Change the smoothness to about right here. Go to intensity, change it to red. And amplitude down to about 75. Elevation to about... 65 and hold on yeah and change to it to a pix <coughs> wow excuse me pixels wrap around hold on I'm still playing with it a little bit too and just make it look as cool as you want it and then you're gonna slow mo this clip right here you're gonna make that slow mo and where it gets all slow-mo you're gonna want it you're gonna trim it whenever, wherever you want it but you're gonna add an, we're gonna add some effects you're gonna make reset the none bring in a brightness reset to none bring up brightness to 10 and contrast to 10 next we're gonna bring in no wait, we're gonna bring in a uh, crap color balance. Bring it on in. We're just gonna change it a little bit. Just just to make it look like a little bit of color. Right there, it doesn't look too good. But now we're going to bring in a glow. 
Reset that to none. And just bring it to about 1.0 around there. It doesn't really have to be perfect. But now you can see what my mine is. And that's it. Thanks to Guy Designs. Once again, I'm going to push your description in the right because you need more subs. And I love you. Nama. But um, that's it. I'll see you guys later.